When I was teenage, difficult age, I was into the Protestant reformers. Posters of Calvin and Zwingli on my wall. Autographed copy of the Papal Ball to Rachel Love Leo the Leo the Tenth. P.S. You're excommunicated. I thought it was a, I thought, I thought it was a kiss, but I said the tenth. My, my enthusiasm, my enthusiasm could never be sated on the phone to my friend Katie. Did you see him yesterday? You know who in the churchyard at Wittenberg, isn't he dead gorgeous? So, oh, Saturday night meeting. Katie in the wimpy or the golden egg, tartan trousers halfway up our legs, tartan armbands, tartan ankle socks, tartan scarf saying I love John Knox. Because this week, this week in Jackie, in Jackie they did Presbyterians, questionnaire, how Presbyterian are you? And now we're doing a scrapbook. So I said to Katie, I know who you fancy, who she said, that bloke out of the Lollards, I say. Now I do not, Rachel, you old moo. Anyway, I believed in rejecting the doctrine of transubstantiation before you. Oh, Saturday night, youth club, disco can, ties it in my hand, growing warm. A boy comes up to me, looks at my t-shirt, says, hello, I see you're into reform. <laughs> Might be, I say. Yes, he says. It's good, isn't it? What do you think of the edict of form? <laughs> it's alright, I say. Yes, he says. It's good, isn't it? What do you think of the edict of nods? So I slapped him around the face. Next to me, asked him if I wanted to dance. But he was alright, though, really quite nice. And he did look a little like Martin Luther. <laughs> but don't they all under the disco lights?